Good afternoon, Word Wizards. Welcome back to Ravo. Teacher Kathy McDonald leads a daily after-school class for second and third grade struggling readers at Salemwood Elementary. We're going to start off today by doing the Word Web. This reading program called Ravo directly targets fluency, the ability to read aloud without hesitations or false starts, and with good inflection that can only come from understanding the text. The RAVO program was the direct outgrowth of our understanding that at least two-thirds of the children were actually not receiving any emphasis at all on fluency. So the RAVO program was really specifically designed to have the children not only be able to decode, but decode rapidly and with comprehension. If I were to go out and I were to see someone with a bat, where might I see someone using one? Danny? Fenway. Fenway Park, yes. Today, Ms. McDonald is exploring place. the different meanings of a single word. Does anyone know a very popular baseball team around here? Rudy! Red Sox. Red Sox, Red Sox. What do they, kind of championship do they usually end up in if the baseball team does a real good job? The, the World, World Series. Very good. Children come here after a full day of school, and you would assume that they would be tired of reading and learning, but when they enter the classroom, it's a whole new experience, and they come in ready to learn and very excited, and the fact that the skills are things that they can accomplish, and they look at themselves in a whole new way. They look at themselves as readers. Organized around one core word a week, a tool called a word web makes multiple meanings easy to grasp. Kids expand the web by adding words or phrases with related meanings. Let's move on now to this kind of a bat. Casey? A fruit bat. A fruit bat. And where does a fruit bat go, Casey? Where would you find it? Um, at a fruit tree. At a fruit tree. Mm -hmm. Do you know what they call animals that are asleep during the day and are up at night? Give it a try. Go ahead. Nocturnal animals. You are correct. Nocturnal animals. Excellent. A rich knowledge of words helps build fluency. Fluency is one piece of the entire process. The more rapid you are, the more time you can actually allocate to understanding what you've read. It's like riding a bike. You watch little ones beginning to ride a bike, they're wobbling all over the place. They fall down. They don't have the process well consolidated. But as we go along as kids and we begin to practice and practice and practice riding a bike, we don't even think about pedaling anymore until it gets hard. We don't think about keeping the bike straight and we can ride with no hands. RAVO combines vocabulary building exercises like the word web with lessons specifically designed to speed up decoding. These two ingredients are the key to any good fluency program. And sure enough, this after-school program has produced big gains in fluency. Okay, now boys and girls, look at all the words we came up with from one little word bat. 